Your book is called The Turning Point. It's a Teenager's Rebellion by Dr. Linda Lynn. Your son, I mean, he was involved with Satan. Um, he just, I mean, he would steal from you and the family, and he would just, I mean, he was just up to no good. He got, did a little drugs, did he not? A little yes, alcohol, a little Lauren, drinking. He did a little of so everything. So, Linda, if you will, you know, take us back to what it was like and, and your son being out of control and how you, being such a strong parent with your husband, of course, how you were able to endure, as we talked about there, for six years. Mm. With God's great strength and grace, Laurie, did we get through it. When Roy was a small boy, he was, he was like an ideal child. He was good at his grades. He was in the gifted class. We were proud of him, maybe a little too proud of him. Right. And then when the Lord gave me all this music, because I was in another business for about 12 years, and one day the Lord told me to sell my business and to go into another avenue for him, and I had no idea what that was. But there was a lady come to my house, and she said, it's time for you to receive the Holy Spirit. And, and so she, the light of Jesus just hit me. The rivers of water came upon me. Mm -hmm. And Roy was 14 at that time. Right. And he came out of his room, and he said, Mom, you got the Holy Spirit. I said, yes, I did, Roy. How he knew, I'll never know. It's just a God thing. From then on, when those doors opened for me to write the music that I did, the devil took a hold of him and Roy opened doors for satanic rebellion.